Hi everyone, I'm Nancy Peterson. I'm CEO and owner of Display Sales. Today, I'm going to show you how to install your processional banner onto the hardware. Now, I'm in the warehouse of Display Sales, so you may hear some background noise. It's just our team of people working hard to ship out your orders. These are the items that you'll receive. Your banners will come in one shipment, your hardware in a second shipment. You'll receive your oak pole, crossbar with the acorn ends, your stand, eight inch spear, and cord and tassel. The first thing that I'm gonna do is take the top part of my pole and install my spear. Once you get the spear out of the packaging, you'll find that there's a set screw. You need a screwdriver for this, and it lines up with the hook that also has been pre-installed. And this just easily screws on. All right, the next thing that I'm gonna do is put the second half of my pole together with the first part. This is a brass joint, and every once in a while, these two pieces are really difficult to get together. So you may wanna take a little bit of WD-40 if you're having problems putting the two pieces of the pole together. But normally they go together really easily. We'll set this aside for now. And then the next thing I'm going to do is to put the crossbar on my banner. One of your acorn ends should easily come off the end of the crossbar. And we'll just slide the crossbar through your banner pocket. And at the top of your banner, there's a little cut in there, a little buttonhole that that hardware comes through, this, this eyelet and then we'll place the acorn end on the end of the crossbar. All right, now the next thing that I'm going to do is put the cord and tassel on now. And some customers will receive their cord and tassel and there's a knot in it. This cord and tassel has two purposes. One is for a US flag crown set. The other purpose is for processional banners. If your cord and tassel arrives like this, just remove the knot and you have this. Um, I'm just gonna wrap the ends around simply on each end of my crossbar. This typically, customers like, like this to drape down. And then I can just even up my ends by just pulling the middle here. I'm gonna wrap this around one more time. That looks pretty good. Now, some colleges and academic institutions will need this to go onto the eight foot pole just to process through the auditorium or a lot of um, commencements are outdoors. The stands are typically up on stage. So you need an area that is high enough your pole is not going to poke a hole in the seal. So I just attach the hook to the eye, and now the processional banner is ready for the procession of the commencement. Once they get up to the stage, the pole easily slides into the base. And you have a beautiful presentation.